What? 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 Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Dave Gettleman, are you out of your mind? Let me get this straight. Let me get this straight. After you just gave Odo Beckham a ginormous contract. How big was the contract? Hold on. How big was this contract here? I'm just finding out about this. Five-year, $77 million contract. You signed him last year. You signed him to this huge monster deal. And now all of a sudden you realize you don't need him. Look, I'm not a big fan of Odell. I know that. I've had my problems with him. But I mean, gosh, are you kidding me? For a first rounder, a second rounder, and Jabril Peppers, and I still feel like we got ripped off. After all this talk that you had, that you weren't going to trade him, that he's your guy, he's the future, he's going to be great, goodbye, done. In a matter of moments. So Landon Collins we don't need. After oh, after, after you've said for weeks, this is a team to win now. This is a team to win. You guys are going to win now. You can win with Eli. We're going to keep Landon Collins. We're, no, we're going to get rid of Landon Collins. We don't need him. We're going to get rid of Odell Beckham. We don't need him. But we're going to keep Eli Manning, who hasn't been good in seven years. Are you kidding me? Dave Gettleman, get your head out of your mouth. What the heck? You just gave Cleveland a Super Bowl. Jarvis Landry, Kareem Hunt, you just gave him a, you just gave that town their first Super Bowl. You, that, 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 they're bound to win it at this point. You have got to be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. To trade him like that. Oh my gosh. Every giant man should be just sick right now. Absolutely sick. Man, I have a feeling Dave Gellerman has no idea what the heck he's doing. Last year, he told us that was a win-now team. And, and, and they looked everything but. The only good thing he's done is draft Saquon Barkley. And I'm not even sure that has been a good Because you could have had Baker Mayfield. Well, no, you couldn't have had Baker Mayfield. But you could have had Sam Darnold. You could have had Josh Allen. You could, you could have had one of these guys in the um, – or Rosen or somebody. And, and, and no, we don't need a court. No, no, no. We're, we're good. Get rid of Landon Collins. Back and not. I'm, I'm, a, I'm not a Jet or Giant fan. I'm. 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 I'm, I'm a. I am a. Um. Yeah. I'm an observer of both teams. I'm a New York. I'm. I'm. A, I'm a. I'm a guy in the metropolitan area. I don't have a football team anymore. I don't. But those are the two teams I follow the most. But whatever. And you get rid of Landon Collins for nothing. I feel like we got ripped off. Or we they got ripped off on the Otto Beckham deal. Eli's still the guy, though. Eli's still the guy. Eli's the guy at a million years old who's going to lead this team to a Super Bowl. Goodness gracious. You better draft a, you better draft the quarterback in this draft. Because you, what you're saying, getting rid of Collins and getting rid of Beckham, is that you, this is not a win-now situation after, but you, but you told us weeks ago we're not getting rid of Odell. How can any Giant fan trust any word that comes out of your mouth? This guy's making Jerry Reese look like Ernie Acorsi. Goodness. I mean, $51 million, $50 million you, tra- you signed him for. $50 million. And just like that, 
after after a year. You couldn't have done this last year. What did he do between last year and this year that was so egregious that you had to get rid of him? If you wanted to get rid of him, you should have done it before you gave him the big deal. This is so ridiculous. This is so outrageous that the Giants again, again, have allowed this to happen. The Giants are now in total rebuild. It would have been nice if they could come. But wasn't that, wouldn't that be a guy you'd want to rebuild around? Yes, thank you. If I was Saquon too, I'd say, no, 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 I, I have to go. I have to go. No, please, get me out of here. Get me out of this train wreck. Get me out of this sewer. Get me out of this slime that the Giants have become. What the heck, gentlemen? He, he destroyed the Panthers and now he's destroying the Giants. John Mara, where are you? Where are you, John Mara? Please, do you, are you have any say in this? You're the owner, you're the big guy. What, it, what Say something. Go in front of the camera and say something. Explain this. What is happening? How can this be happening? I don't Gosh. Giants fans everywhere. I feel bad for you. This is sickening. This is disgusting. Yes, thank you. And the Redskins, you can get Landon Collins. Doesn't matter. Get rid of everybody. Get rid of Saquon. I dare you. Because he's not, he's, he doesn't, you shouldn't want to sign here. Get rid of Saquon. If you want to totally rebuild, get rid of Saquon. Get rid of everybody. But Eli's the guy you keep. Because we have to rebuild around him. What the heck? I miss Jerry Reese. I miss Ben McAdoo. The incompetence that is now... Oh, my gosh. And I heard a couple days or two ago they were going to get rid of it, but I never thought they were actually going to do it. I mean, is it better than what Pittsburgh got for Antonio Brown? Yeah, but not by much. This is so sickening. I am so beyond fear at what the Giants have done over the last – couple of days it is unbelievable over the, the last this this over the last week two weeks of what Dave Gettleman is doing is this is on Gettleman and he hired Shermer who I don't know I mean he's just trading great player after great player with you know, no concern no who cares Olivier Vernon goodbye Damon Harrison, no. Eli Apple, Weston, Weston Witchburg. And yet they've kept Eli. And I love Eli. I adore Eli. But, but, he's not the guy that you want to, of all those guys, I get rid of him first. But no, we have to, we have to keep Eli. He has to be the one. He has to be there for us. Because we have to thank him for the two Super Bowls that were a, billion years ago we have to we, we can't we can't you know say anything bad I mean the Ravens just got rid of Joe Flacco so what is the Super Bowl mean? You know, Jerry Rice didn't finish his career with the Niners Joe Montana didn't a Super Bowl shouldn't mean you have to stay with the guy the guy should stay there it doesn't force you to be there it is unbelievable how, what has happened here? It is just ridiculous. The Giants, Dave Gettleman has just has, has decided to burn this franchise to the ground. And the sad thing is, I don't even know if you can fire him next. I, I want to fire him now. The sad thing is, I don't know if you can because we have to see what the draft does. And even if the Giants are terrible next year, they'll be able to say, well, it's a rebuild. What do you expect from us? What do you expect us to do? This is what the Giants have become now. This is it's really New York. Are you happy about this? We wanted to get rid of Jerry Reese. We wanted to get rid of Ben McAdoo. We did. And now it's almost as bad. And now I look up at John Mara. And I can say, how do you let your dad's franchise 
your dad, who is probably rolling over in his grave, God bless his soul. He and George Young, who saved this franchise. And how can you allow this to happen? How can you allow all of this? Where are you in this? How can you let this guy just decide to get rid of every single good player on this team? And, but the one guy who everybody, who's not, is nowhere near as good as he once was, he's the one that has to stay. You better draft a quarterback. But you have to draft a quarterback. Please. You have to. That, Dwayne Haskins, come on, please. Trade up and get a quarterback. And then, then I'll be like, okay, I understand it. Other than that, and even then, I don't get... Because wouldn't you want to have your new franchise quarterback surrounded by one of the best receivers in the game? <sighs> Landon Collins, no, we don't need him. Odell Beckham, we don't need him. Olivier Vernon, we don't need him. But Eli, we need him. What a what a So yeah, that's all I have to say. Um players the Giants have gotten rid of since Dave Godwin was hired. DRC, JPPs, Fluker, Pug, Richbird, Kernan, Aquara, Apple, Harrison, Vernon. Eli Manning is 38 years old. <sighs> what happened? What is this? How could this happen? How can this happen again and again and again? How is this guy allowed to just continue to run roughshod over this franchise? This is unbelievable. It is a complete disgrace. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm just saying words at this point, but I, I can't even let words come out of my mouth in a natural forming way. This bombshell to come out, oh gosh, that you let a top tier receiver just go like that the year after you signed him to this massive, ridiculously large contract. And you told everybody, we're not trading him. Explain that. All right, get in front of the press. Get in front of the camera and explain that. You and John Mara need to sit in front of us and explain what the heck. You, wh why? Why would you lie to us like that? So, I don't know. He's Maybe he'll do well for Cleveland. At least I hope so for his sake. But, I don't know. I, I am... I am so angry by this. I don't even know what to say. Is this what? What a joke! What a joke! What a disaster! They better not come into this season and tell us this is a win now team. They better not do that again, because we knew last season's team wasn't a win now team, even though they were trying to tell us that. And now this season. Isn't this also the same guy that got rid of Josh Norman in Carolina? Got rid of Steve Smith? He really doesn't value talent. He really doesn't. I don't know. I, I, I think I'm done here. But unless somebody has a question. The Giants are a joke. Dave Gettleman's a joke. Whole organization. John Mara is letting this all happen. He's let this one guy take complete control. And I thought James Dolan would be the biggest the biggest loser of this week. But no, Dave Gettleman has gone right to the top. Taking whatever was left of the Giants and just crushing it. I'm done. Thank you guys for watching. Gosh, what a joke. What a joke. God bless Odell. Take care.